We close out Valentine's Day week with some unfortunate news for single women. Some data shows they're losing out in today's economy. So here's a look by the numbers. Today, we learned the median price for a new home rose to $350,000 in January. That's according to the National Association of Realtors. That is a 15% spike from a year ago and the highest median price on record for the month of January, which is typically a sleepy time for home sales. Of course, if you're single, you are a lot more likely to be shouldering the entire cost yourself. And while collectively American women earn less than men, the median income for single women is even lower, $32,000 a year, while partnered women make a median of $40,000 a year, according to Pew. And then there's inflation, of course. Now that's at a 40-year high. Some experts say it's hitting single people even harder because they're not splitting expenses. Married people might also be getting tax advantages, discounted family rates, things like gym memberships or cell phone plans too. But while single life can have its downsides, more Americans of all ages are choosing to go it alone. A record 35% of U.S. adults between 25 and 50 had never been married as of 2018. In 1970, that share was just 9%, according to the Institute for Family Studies. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.